Welcome everybody to another episode of Terraria. So, we haven't played Terraria in a long time. I mean, last episode was recorded on my old computer, which is completely insane. But a new update recently came out and we're here to play it. So, I don't know if you guys remember, but this was our old house. We have just defeated the Moon Lord, so <clears throat> we technically finished the game. But, there is a new update. And I just got cooked out by accident. There is a new update. And that update mainly involves the new event. And that means we're going to need the dude to spawn in. And we do have some houses open. So that's nice. Yeah, I think we have some houses open. Alright guys, so right now, if you don't hear the music and the mobs, an event is actually going on right now. I think it's the Blood Moon event, actually. Um... But either way, we really can't do anything until the new NPC arrives because the new NPC is kind of the core of what this update is all about. So we might just have to play around until he comes. That's literally all we can really do, honestly. But yeah, guys, if you guys don't remember, this was our old world. I should probably give you guys a tour just because I know most of you probably were not here. And most of you don't even know what this game is, probably, but this is an old game we used to play on this channel. Um, those are kind of some of the things I have to do. But yeah, this is one of my favorite games of all time, honestly. So yeah, guys, really, what we're going to have to do is we're just going to have to wait, like I said, for the NPC to arrive. Once the NPC arrives, the fun can start. Um, but honestly, even with the new update, there's other stuff we could have done. I just kind of got lazy and never did it. Like, it's mostly collecting. Like, we need to get... We need to build a tree farm, we need to get the event trophies, we need the truffle. Like, the truffle mm, NPC guy. I don't know why he never came, but yeah. We got a lot of the trophies, but not all of them. We got, like, a lot of the banners, not all of them. Um, the new NPC guy could sell us the new types of armor, so that's kind of cool. Also, the event stuff. But yeah, honestly, the only NPC that I don't have, other than the new one, is a truffle. And guys, it's, like, a long history. The truffle never comes. I have the biome here... I have the house, I have everything in it, but the truffle, truffle has never arrived. I've probably waited like six episodes for this thing to arrive and it's just never came. So yeah guys, I don't know, I'm probably just going to stop talking and wait for the dude to come because I don't know how long it's going to take to be honest. I do not know how long it's going to take. Alright guys, so what I'm going to do, what I've learned about this NPC <clears throat> is that you actually have to find him. You have to defeat certain bosses and then he will appear and obviously I've defeated every boss so... That's completely fine. Now, he will just spawn on any layer of the world. So, we literally have to go find him. That's what I'm going to do. And I brought this life analyzer to make it easier. So, yeah, guys. I'm going to go look for him. Guys, this is very exciting. I think we have found him. I think that is him right there. Oh, this is exciting. I've been looking for him forever. Now, my keyboard starts not working. Oh, this is great. Ah, uh, please. Okay, keyboard. I need your cooperation here. Okay, I gotta fix my keyboard. Alright, guys. So, we have finally found him. And so, of course, he has all this stuff to sell. And then he's the only NPC that actually has a different currency. He has defender medals. Which is kind of cool. Uh, so, yeah. We have to buy these two items to start the battle and then through the battle we'll gain defender medals and then yeah we'll be able to buy stuff so that's pretty cool so let's buy like two of these two of these and all right i think he'll come back to the house so he'll go ahead and take a home in our house let's go fight this you know what? i'm like ready to get into it let's just go ahead and fight the event like right now We'll place these two things and let's go fight this event. Like I'm already, I'm already ready. I looked for the guy. Surprisingly, not for that long of time, but it wasn't an easy job. So let's fight him. I guess Dude, this is a perfect place, like right here. Let's fight him right here. Let's place this down. The old army is approaching. Ooh, let's do it.
that was the first victory of the one old armies that I've done. And that feels really good. Let's go pick up whatever is there. Alright, I like it. Let's go. Alright, so let's kind of step back and analyze what just happened. So, we got the... What is this? The Aerial Bane. So that's cool. And then we got the Skeleton Banner. We got a Gato Egg. Got a lot of Defender and Dark Mage trophies. What is this? I want to see what this is. Oh, it's this little thingy. That's kind of cute. Honestly, I'd rather have my Flying Minotaur, though. Just going to be completely honest. So, guys, here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to go ahead and clean up my inventory. And then we're going to fight this thing a couple more times just to get all the items and get a bunch of Defenders. Things. So, yeah, we're going to fight it a bunch more. But I'm just going to clean up my inventory. And then, in the end, we'll have, like, a big chest with all the new items. Alright everybody, so it's been at least like two hours and I've been just grinding and grinding and grinding through these crystals and I managed to get a lot of stuff. Not all of it, but literally all the important stuff I actually did get. I just wanted to check if the truffle got there because that would have been exciting also. So let's go through all of it. Oh, and I just did something I didn't mean to do. Alright, so let's go through through all of it no, I broke a torch so obviously let's just take out the least important stuff so we have the banners so all of these these are just banners and all of these we gotta hang up so you know what we're actually gonna do that right now here that one that one that one that one and then we have a couple more. Just like this. And we have one more, just like that. Alright, so I don't know if any of those are duplicates, but they really shouldn't be. And the blood moon is rising, so that's going to make it kind of difficult for us to do our work. You know, that's fine, we'll figure it out. Let's place the extra banners back in. You know, let's place this and let's summon that to kind of protect us a bit. All right, so now that the banners are gone, uh, so first of all, let's just take out kind of this is the currency, the defender medals, and with those defender medals that I got while fighting this, I bought this armor set. So this is only one of the armor sets, the Dark Artists, which has to do with things like summons. And I did buy two summoning weapons. So the Ballista and the Lightning Aura, which is kind of cool. Obviously, these are leftover diamonds that I did not use. And then we got some of the weapons and decorative stuff. So we've got the Phantom Phoenix, which is the bow that it drops. The Betsy's Wrath, which is its magical weapon. I can kind of show it off. It kind of just spreads out uh, fireballs. I don't know how to explain it, but yeah, it just kind of throws out fireballs. Let's put that there. And then we got the flying dragon, which is like a sword. And these are kind of lower tier stuff from lower tier, uh, lower tier mobs. And we got the aerial bane. So I think these are the lower tier things from the lower tier drops. And this is the thing from Betsy, the actual... Um, boss stuff. I think there's one more weapon that I didn't get, but oh well. We got this is also another weapon from the low tier. We got the war table banner. So we got another banner we should probably put up. So let's go see. Is this like a big banner or what kind of banner is this? Okay, so it is like a big banner. Well, we can put that up just for now. We might take it down. I don't know if this kind of is a banner kind of thing 
All right, so then we got the ogre mask, which is like a vanity item. We got the ogre trophy, and then we got the dark mage mask, and we got Betsy's trophy. So we can actually add both of those on here. There's the ogre trophy. There's the Betsy trophy. Oh, right. This is the dark mage trophy. I was looking for one more trophy because I knew there was one more. And yeah, we do have the Dark Mage Trophy. So there's three trophies in total from that event. And we did get all three, which is very, very nice. And then we just got some, like, drops. Just, like, the Monk's Belt, Huntress Buckler, and Apprentice Scarf. These are all just kind of drops. And for me, probably the, the most fun part for me is pets. So I already showed off the Gatto Egg. So let's show off these two. So the Dragon Egg. So that just gives us like a little flying dragon with us, which is kind of nice. Alright guys, for some reason it literally won't let me put the creeper egg on. I have no idea why, but it does not matter. So yeah, that's most. Uh, it's most. It's not all, but it's most of the stuff. And if we go up to the actual dude himself, I'll show you everything we can buy. So let's go up to the dude. Yeah, this is all the stuff we can buy, so it's kind of very confusing. These are all um, the summoning weapons, and as you go down, they get higher in tiers. So there's four types. Obviously, the crystals, the defender's forge, and there's just a lot of armor. So, like, this is one armor set, this is an armor set, this, this. So, in total, there's eight. This is the one I bought because this has to do with summons. This has to do with movement, speed, melee, and, um, yeah, more sentries. So yeah, it's actually kind of very expensive. It's like each of them is like a hundred, and you only get like a little bit per one event. So it's very expensive, but hopefully you guys are satisfied with that because I did get most of them. So real quick, let's put that pet back on. And I have a lot of stuff in here, so we can just kind of shove all this stuff in here. There's nothing really too revolutionary in here, but it is a lot of cool stuff. Okay, guys, so this is going to end off today's episode. We did the entire event, and we got most of the stuff, so I'm pretty happy with that. So, guys, I enjoyed myself today. If you enjoyed, make sure to like and comment as a personal channel, and I'll see you guys later. God bless, and goodbye.